Hello, welcome to my YouTube channel. I'd like to introduce myself while we watch this watercolour demo. My name is Tony. I'm a self-taught artist from Australia and I love all things creative and I love to experiment with new ideas and styles and techniques. I first fell in love with creativity when I was a kid and I used to watch my dad, who was a portrait artist, create beautiful realistic portraits using only a graphite pencil. So I started my adventure there, uh, learning what I could from my dad. And I sucked really bad, really bad at first. But the more I did it, the less I sucked. And like magic, I was confident with graphite portraiture. But I was, and still am, a very curious cat. And I wanted to learn more. I wanted to move to painting. But the idea of colour terrified me. It was like a foreign alien that I had no business interacting with. So I thought I would tiptoe into colour with digital art. This was way back in the early 2000s and digital art was very new and fresh and the styles were so exciting and it was really, really cool. Uh, there wasn't a massive amount of tutorials on YouTube like there is now, but there was enough to get me started and I got myself a Wacom Bamboo and a Keygen hacked version of Photoshop. And I sucked for ages, then I sucked a little less, and you know how it goes, all of a sudden, I didn't suck as much. So that gave me the confidence to move into the scary world of painting. I thought I would dive into the deep end and started with oils, and I'm glad I did, because I found that I could bring my digital styles over to the canvas, and I didn't struggle as much as I thought I would. I had a good base from my drawing days and, and playing with digital painting, it translated well with the oil paint, but I did suck, just not as much. And I slowly got my confidence up with my painting as well. So fast forward 24 years and I've found that creative joy in so many things. I've experimented with tons of different mediums and techniques, but I still wanna learn more and get better. And that's what I love most about the creative world. There's no end game, there's no like skill cap. Uh, you're constantly improving and I look back at a lot of the things that I've made in the past that at the time I thought was the best of what I had to offer only to realize that the next piece was better not always sometimes it still sucked uh, but I suck less and I don't stress the suckiness anymore I just chalk it up to a crummy day and I move on so if you want to come along with this continuous journey with me and I will be uploading videos documenting my process with different styles and mediums and hopefully along the way you might pick up something you want to try or if like me you just like watching the joy of the creative process. Subscribe if this is something you feel jives with you and I hope you enjoy this magical creative adventure.